developments tonight in a deadly crash we first told you about back in May. A Connecticut woman was killed when police say a speeding car collided with her vehicle at a Foster intersection. Today, the other driver answered to charges that he was going more than 100 miles per hour at the time of the crash. Eyewitness News reporter Sean Daly is live outside of Superior Court with the Providence Mobile Newsroom. A foster man pleaded not guilty today here at Superior Court in Providence on a charge of killing a woman while driving more than 100 miles an hour. Say your name, sir. Will Gerard. And your date of birth? December 27th. 19-year-old Will Gerard said almost nothing today when he faced a felony charge of driving to endanger, death resulting. It was back in May at the intersection of routes 94 and 6 in Foster. 38-year-old Tracy Guy of Griswold, Connecticut was killed when prosecutors say Will Gerard driving a gold Buick Regal on Route 94 collided with her red Ford Focus on Route 6. The state police says Will Gerard was doing 105 miles an hour in a 40 mile an hour zone. Tracy Guy was pronounced dead at the scene. To be traveling a 40, in a 40 mile per hour zone at 105 miles an hour is, is, is outrageous and uh, we just ask everybody out there to obey the speed limits and obey the traffic laws and you know just operate in a safe manner. Now Tracy Guy's family was here at the courthouse for this arraignment but they were way too distraught to speak afterwards. Live at Superior Court with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News.